Where do these ones go then? What's up, P Nation? Today is a very exciting day because we are going to go camping what? in Antarctica. What? It's actually Leah's first time camping. I'm very nervous. <laughs> I'm very scared. I'm very excited. I'm very cold already. So let's go. <laughs> So we are walking out to our campsite right now. Um, it is snowing. There is zero visibility. Just kidding. You can see, but <laughs> you're, you can usually see lots of mountains around us. And right now there are none. <laughs> so also this is my first time camping. And I can say that my first time camping was in Antarctica. So let's get out there. All right, we are hiking out to the site and it's a very diverse group of people. This is, like Leah said, her first camping trip. A lot of people in Antarctica, as you would think, have been on many camping trips before this. So this is nothing big for those people. We're just hiking on a glacier right now. We'll probably be at our destination in about 20 minutes. It's kind of right off the ice shelf road. So we're gonna stay basically in the abyss. You can't really see anything around us. It's just gonna be solid white snow. Okay, so we're out here on the Ross Ice Shelf. We're about 10 feet above sea level right now. There's about three feet of snow on top of us. And so to, in order to get our tent down, we're gonna have to dig underneath this three feet of snow, put our stakes in, which we'll show you how to do that later. And then we'll be all set up. The wind is blowing kind of hard. It's about 10 miles out of the south. And it's probably with a wind chill about minus five outside right now, which is why my face is so red. So we're gonna get these tents set up, drink some hot chocolate, and then call it a day. Okay. Now we are out here and we are setting up camp and we have our tent and I've never pitched a tent. So let's try it. <laughs> what is this? The first thing you want to do when pitching a tent is figure out what your tent looks like. Oh, it's blue and um, it's got a lot of string and I think this is the top of it okay okay this looks good this looks like this looks like a tent right here sure does just give us a moment we are professionals but we're working with some fresh powder over here you got sticks you got sticks you got you got long ones and they stick together. Look. Wow. Oh, more. Two sticks. Okay. That's the end of that. Keep up the momentum. If you get lazy, you're going to quit. I think that's it. <laughs> Where do these ones go then? <laughs> then you take it down. These <laughs> sticks don't belong yet. No. Why is it so hard? putting up our tent getting the snow I don't know if you can tell but we got some fresh powder on the ground I'm trying to clear the path so I can make the tea thing oh my Line in the ice. Now we're making a perpendicular line. Oh, 
now we are fastening our tent to the ice so we don't blow away tonight in a snowstorm that is imminent and threatening just kidding it's a great day so we have our slot we have our perpendicular pole in the ice and now we're using a piece of bamboo how does this go just like this and we're putting our bamboo down in the ice and we're packing her down getting her in there making sure she's not moving Oh yeah, my dad's gonna be proud of me. Nuts. We dug a hole for our bamboo stake and we secured our tent to the ground. I think we're done. Okay, so now we're basically going to make an ice wall using ice blocks. <laughs> One ice block. It looks really light. It looks like foam, but it's really heavy. Let's go take it over to our ice wall. <laughs> it's really heavy. All right, now we're in the tent. We got everything set up. I tried to lay down and my back just felt like it was being iced down because the ice is just seeping through all the layers. The foam, the bag, the tent, the tarp, it's all good. We're gonna be um, a little chilly tonight because we are, after all, in Antarctica. So that's it for today. We're gonna try and fall asleep now, but the sun never goes down. So we're going to try and pretend like this is just a nap during the middle of the day. Hopefully we get some sleep tonight, but. Yeah, I think the snow <laughs> pressing against the tarp is gonna really, really put me to sleep. It's yeah, very kind of sounds like rain. Yeah, you know, which we don't have patter. here. Also, it's snowing, and that doesn't happen here. We live in a desert. It only snows two inches a year, and it's been so warm recently that the climate's just like creating snowing. the perfect temperature yeah. for snow, and it's been very interesting. So we're going to cozy up into our sleeping bags and hopefully this negative five degree weather outside doesn't chill us to the bone. Supposed to get to negative 21 tonight, but we'll see. Jeez. <laughs> Antarctica. It was a more comfortable night than I was expecting. I definitely checked the clock at like 5.30 this morning though, and I don't think I had gotten any sleep at that time. But when the alarm went off at seven, I was definitely dreaming. So I think maybe an hour and a half of sleep. Yeah, inside the, the sleeping bag, it was like super duper comfortable and pretty warm. And I'm just so thankful for toe warmers or else I think my feet would have fallen off in the middle of the night and I would have had no feet. So now we've packed up our camp. We put all of our tents away. We're gonna haul everything back to the car and then we are shuttling back to town. This is it from our camping trip. My hat straight? Yep. Okay, we are out here. We're gonna come. <laughs> all right, so we are out here on the Ross ice shelf. 
All right. Hey, you got this in here. <laughs> what is this? The first thing you want to do when pitching a tent is figure out what your tent looks like. 